What's going on, your team? Back at it again. Yeah, back at it again, y'all. Title, thumbnail, y'all know what's going on. Lisa content going crazy. Um, her birthday was just recently. Um, it you know, so she turned up, she went crazy. But you guys, ever since her birthday, you've been requesting Lisa content. Now, this is what's interesting. I've always, you know, I'm a sucker for like behind the scenes, just natural, raw, like authenticity to the to the footage. Um, when you do when you kind of go for black pink you don't really get them on their own nine times out of ten you're more than likely gonna see all of the members or at least them interacting right now that's whether you watch diaries you know 24 7 now do give and tell that they do have their own youtube channel but i mean still more than likely they're gonna have more official like black pink content than individual with that being said you guys were spamming this lisa pop-up shop now i do think there's like four or five parts to it so if you do want to react to it um just let me know in the comment section down below just drop a part two or you know drop the link to it um I, you guys did request a lot of this pop-up shop but this video in particular i just saw a lot so um yeah man like i'm super excited like i said it's a little behind the scenes and you know lisa is my bias if you didn't know and you're new to the channel um so it, it's gonna be nice to kind of see how if i don't know but if she does interact with fans that one-on-one -on -one connection and how it how she handles it usually um when they when they kind of go one-on-one -on -one, and when i say they i mean black pink there there tends to be like a little different side they feel nervous i noticed that with jenny um when she was on the red carpet event and she sat between i think it was adele and rihanna was it if i'm not mistaken or somebody like that i can't remember but i know she seemed a little nervous in one v ones um but that was prior to me knowing that she deals with anxiety so i i wasn't aware of that but it makes sense um rose tends to be a little more nervous too the only person i really see at a calm settled is jisoo maybe because she's just a little more mature older when it comes to things like that i don't know that's just how i you know interpret it but it's gonna be cool to see lisa uh kind of go 1v1 i want to see how it is i've never yet to you know see her talk one-on-one -on -one. so i'm done wasting your time let's go ahead and get straight into it see what she cooked up and uh yeah what y'all got me into man no cat according to many eyewitnesses lisa was spotted today in the southern suburb of seoul called pungyo a planned city built in 2001 in order to alleviate the demand for apartments in gangnam the global ambassador of Celine made a special surprise appearance at the grand opening of a Celine pop-up store at the luxurious Hyundai department store. And who Lisa was seen Lisa? by fans and paparazzi, smiling and posing for pictures, looking as mesmerizing as ever, dripped in everything Celine. Lisa's famous wolf cut, previously God. seen in Paris, did not appear Damn, in that woman event. is fine, Lisa bro. Lisa is trending currently worldwide Sheesh. at numbers three and four under the hashtags Lisa and Celine and also Lisa Celine Korea. The tags have garnered over 150,000 tweets each so far. The staff members seem to be very protective and caring towards Lisa. Hopefully strong security measures were in place. It's always a sight for sore eyes, seeing Lisa make a public appearance nonetheless. The Lisa Monobon's impact on fashion and music is unparalleled, and her Instagram continues to remain the number one influencer account in Korea and number eight worldwide. What do you think? Are you for real? I don't Please know if comment, that's fact. If like, is it really? Subscribe. Oh, that's crazy. What the? I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm not doubting it. You know what I mean? I'm not doubting because obviously it's Lisa, but what? That means what? Jisoo got to be right behind her, no? Number one influencer? That's crazy, bro. What? I, I'm, you know, I, I don't know. I, I think it's just because 
maybe it's Dude, my it's lack of um not maybe it is definitely more so you know life is you know at some point about accountability so we got to keep it a stack right i don't really see her engage with fans as much as jisoo now that doesn't mean that she doesn't that just means i'm lacking in that department of keeping up to date right um some kind of lisa shipper i am right no nah, no nah, but seriously i i feel like jisoo does a a crazy amount of like lives or interacting with fans and once again obviously congratulations to lisa number one in korea and then south korea to be specific and then number eight worldwide really though that's tough i'm shocked because i'm curious i'm curious right how so who would be number one worldwide i'm thinking either ronaldo or dwayne the rock johnson right would have to be or nah i could not kim k kim k gotta at least be top 10 though but that's crazy bro lisa is her do you hear me that's tough bro look at the fans in the back that's tough that's tough you learn something new every day i would imagine so okay so put it this way it with her being the number one in south korea and i don't know how the how the like culture works over there um for being the number one like uh influencer right okay so does she get like a a how do, how do you say it I, I don't know what they would call it but does she get like a special ride anywhere in korea because like for example i know that ronaldo um and dwayne the rock johnson i think with ronaldo anywhere in in spain that he goes he has like a free ride for life meaning like at any point in time there's like an airport or he's in trouble like somebody comes to his aid he calls somebody it's like free of charge he has like a a key to the city and for Dwayne the rock johnson i think it's in hawaii obviously i think it is but i don't i'm not i'm not too particular i'm not too um what's the word what's the i'm not too sure about which city in particular but same thing like they honor him like he gets the red carpet rolled out when he lands on the you know from the jet so does lisa have that same treatment when she lands in south korea do they go like all out and is she like intact with like the government um or mayor of the city you know what i mean like is she connected with those people out there too because i mean number one south korea that's huge you know and then number eight worldwide so i'm not quite sure if they believe in that special treatment but if they do just a little fun fun fact i would like to know um but that's that's lit bro i did not know that's crazy powerful powerful lisa is her no cap um but yeah man this is dope uh i you know i know they're ambassadors for like Celine and then obviously the other girls have, you know, like um, Saint Laurent and then you have, you know, Dior and uh, Chanel. But bro, ambassador is just like an understatement when you're carrying the brand like that. You know what I mean? At like, come on, keep it a fact. Like, come on, be honest. There's no way in hell you're number one in a country, right? In a country, you're number one. And then worldwide, you're number eight and you're not carrying that brand. That's nah bro anybody that's saying that lisa's not carrying that brand bro you're a hater that is crazy even if i was lisa i'd be talking i obviously i stay humble you know what i mean because blackpink is known to be humble but every now and then i gotta talk my shit you feel what i'm saying like i'm number one i'm carrying this brand she owns celine at this point that's it is what it is you know what i mean but that's just me as a blink and lisa supporter talking shit for her you know what i mean because She's too humble to do it. So, you know, we got to step up and do it for her. But yeah, that's awesome. 
Um, I know you guys did want more Lisa content, so if you do want more, you know what to do. You guys have been on the channel long enough to know. Go crazy in the comment section down below, um, and whatever I see the most, we'll get to it. We are on the road to 50K. I know you guys know that, and we, hey man, we're 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 climbing slowly but surely. We're less than 10,000 away. Yeah, I know it's been a journey. We're less than 10,000 away from 50,000 subscribers. So, um, yeah, man, it's absolutely free to hit the subscribe button and turn on that post bell notification. Help run the numbers up. Let us meet our goal of 50,000 and dreamers 50,000 subscribers and uh go crazy man we got more bangers to drop and i can't do that if i'm here though so i will catch you in the next video i'm out of here sheesh bitch roll up one more blood i'm getting sober i need more weed just because you see me on the net don't mean you know me say you're getting money boy that's cap you gotta show me just because we cordial do not mean that you my homie